What's up YouTube, Yoke Gang, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about the IWI Ace Galil Pistol chambered in 308. Y'all hear that? Pistol? Ooh. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait, I'm excited. Come on, cause we got to talk about it. Kevin, good morning. What's up? What's up? Good morning. You all buy you lonesome? Yes, I am. Sometimes it's better that way. <laughs> and we are back. And I'm so excited because I want to let you know all about this beautiful little pistol here. Mm. Y'all already know, IWI, I have one, and I completely love my first Galil. This is my second, and I am not only loving it, this little quick clear check, she's clear, visual for you. You hear that rack? Yeah. Woo. She is so well put together, I absolutely love her. She is, the overall length of her is 22.5 inches, the barrel length is 11.8 inches. She weighs six pounds, which is a nice weight for her. It's not overly cumbersome feeling, nor is it overly heavy. It's, I mean, just right. My arms, I don't have the longest arms, as you guys know, and this is the perfect compact feeling pistol. If not, my favorite, one of my favorites. So far, I can tell I haven't even shot her yet, but just the feel of her is just so, mm, just you just pull her into you very nicely. She has the EOTech red dot on her. She has adjustable iron sights and a whole lot of Picatinny rails. She has a whole extended Picatinny rail on the top. She has one on the sides. She has actually these, um, plastic plate cover things. She has Picatinis under that. I'm assuming that this is going to allow you to handle the rifle a lot better when it starts to get warm when you um, actually are shooting her. You have Picatinis under here, everywhere. You can put all types of stuff on here. She's ambi as far as the safety controls go. She has an ambi on the left side, ambi on the right side. Mag release as well on both sides. Her grip is a smooth grip, but it feels nice. This little extension flare down here at the bottom gives you more sense of security as far as having that nice firm grip on her. Her trigger, I already know is going to be amazing. So I'm, uh, we'll talk about that once we get that first shot out. And her brace folds. It is folding, but I just don't have enough strength in my thumb to actually get that folded. All right, so this is how she looks folded. So compact and tiny. Um, I'm not sure if you can still fire her with it folded. It doesn't seem like a comfortable situation, so I don't think so. But when you extend, it looks good. It looks really good. So with all that being said, y'all ready to shoot? Because I am ready to shoot. Super ready, let's go. Y'all ready? Let's go. We are in a safe and controlled environment. We are at the gun range. We are in the gun range by ourselves. Our range officer is right out the door. And we're gonna take lane eight. This one has a little more light. Lane eight, yeah. All right. Did I say that she came with one 20 round magazine? She comes with one 20 round magazine. We are gonna check it out to see how nice the magazine is. We're shooting bronze 308 Winchester. This is 147 grain. 2,780 feet per second. Okay, 
I did say we we're shooting bronze. Let's know this magazine and see how this feels. I'm almost leaning towards 308 being one of my favorite calibers. I think so, but 308 has really shown me a whole lot of love lately. The magazine feels nice. It is a P Mag. Yeah. Very nice. We um did I say we had the EOTech right down on there? Yeah, I believe so. I'm excited. A look she looks so battle ready like ready ready this puts a real big smile on my face really big okay magazine feels nice it's not a metal magazine y'all already know I'm not um, fond of those. Somebody asked me why wasn't I? There's no particular reason. I just haven't had really good experiences with metal magazines and you only got to screw me once and that's it. But that's how she looks. Let's see how this sits. Beautifully. Beautiful. Let's get this first shot in. Okay, let's turn this on first. Woo! Did y'all hear that? Wow. Zero recoil. Let me step up a little bit so you can see my body. This is so smooth. So. Not only is the recoil so well managed in this system to where sometimes I can shoot a rifle or a pistol or whatever and I can actually feel it in my teeth where um, when you cheek the stock how the vibration I don't even get that from this none <sighs> she's clear all right let's see what this EO tech is Very good. Very good. Let's go for Dome. Now, I do have other magazines that we are already preloaded. Whoa. So let's get those. Okay. Here's our new mag. Nice. Nicer. I did say she was six pounds. I can feel. I mean, it's not a drastic weight difference with the magazine, but I can feel the weight difference. It's become a lot more front heavy, but that's fine. Love it. She's 
clear. Let's bring the target up. Let's see what happens. Okay, I was telling you she was getting a little heavier in the front. But may peace be with them. All right, let's get a fresh target. Thought I heard somebody come in. Heat-wise, she's not hot at all. I'm still able to put my finger on the top of this picatinny rail and hold it with not no, now she's warm, but she's not hot at all. These plastic covers, I mean, they work wonders. Very well thought out. And I'm excited. <laughs> Do I need to say any more? Do I need to say any more? Do I need to say any more? Nice. All right, so we got about 40 rounds left. I don't want it to end. Two mags left. <laughs> much better I just I was telling you about it becoming a little more front heavy um, I just I guess improved my stance held it a little closer to my body leaned into her a little bit more brought her into me a little bit more and uh, it fixed the problem more magazine left Last bag, 20 rounds. We gonna take, we gonna take it easy with this one, okay? We gonna shoot and marinate each one. Again, still very cool. Did I tell you she had adjustable iron sights? She does. So if you ever have an issue,
She's safe. Let's take a look at the target. Done better. Still very vital. The IW Isle Galil A 308 pistol. Let's get some final thoughts on her. You should already know exactly how I'm feeling. So let's clean up and let's go talk. know in the live chat what do you think well I don't know if I'm smiling hard enough for you to know exactly what I think she's clear but just listen to this listen listen to that she's clear here she is the IWI IOIO IWI Galil Ace pistol, pistol chambered in 308. This is, if not, I'm not gonna jump the gun yet. If this is not my fave, it's one of my favorites, definitely. And I have to bring out all of my favorites one time and make a video covering everything that it is that I love the most in my lineup. But this definitely earned her spot off rip. No if, ands, or buts about it at all. I keep talking about how nice and snug she is. You hold her close to your body and you just become one with the pistol. The grip again, it's not textured in any way. They have very minimal texture on here, but it still allows you to keep that nice firm grip on her. I, I, I'm shooting indoors today, but even if I was outdoors, I don't see where I would have a problem with this at all. So with that being said, this has definitely, like I said, earned a spot in my face. Let me turn my red dot off so I don't lose my, my battery. These batteries expensive. <clears throat> all right, so Yoke Gang, listen. If you have not yet checked out www.yokegang.com, make sure that you do. Make sure you pick up a gun bag patch and a t-shirt. Support the channel so we can continue to bring you some fire content like we've been doing. For those of you who've already have made the purchase, thank you so much. I cannot thank you enough. Uh, but I am sorry I am going to have to let you go. This is where it ends, Yoke Gang. I love y'all for life, as you know. Peace.